New details tonight, two Central Florida professional athletes, victims of thieves, and they're beginning to wonder if they're being targeted. Fox 35's Patrick Perez is joining us live here in the studio tonight. And Patrick, at least one of these athletes thinks this may be orchestrated. Yeah, Ray and Luann, first they got into his garage, and then just yesterday they stole his teammate's car. It's either a coincidence, he says, or something much bigger. This is what Paralympian John Edward Heath came home to after training in Texas for several weeks. I woke up one morning and was getting ready to go to the gym, half asleep at like five in the morning. All my stuff was gone. He believes $40,000 worth of belongings were taken, including a shoe collection and firearms belonging to a late friend of his. I'm not really concerned about the shoes. My best friend is no longer here. The firearms were his. So his family gave them to me and they've just traveled the last couple years. The burglary happened back in April at the Advent near Castle Hill Apartments in Claremont. Initially, the former Marine didn't think too much of it until he got a text Wednesday from teammate and Olympian Kenny Bednarik. His car got stolen. Surveillance video shared with Fox 35 shows a thief stealing the silver medalist car outside a home in unincorporated Lake County while someone else in another car watched. We're out here training for the Olympic Games next year. We don't mess with anyone and then all of a sudden now his vehicle stolen and then all of my personal belongings were stolen. Although Claremont police say they don't have any indication right now thieves are targeting athletes like John and Kenny, John thinks otherwise. I think when it comes to my situation and Kenny's situation, I, I don't think that's a coincidence. Two identical people in the same circle, I just, it's, it's got to be orchestrated. And Kenny tells me his car was found today in Clearwater near the Tampa area. As for John's belongings, still no sight of them, but police are on the lookout for this red pickup truck. So if you have any information, give police a call. In the studio, I'm Patrick Perez, Fox 35 News. Patrick.